Hello, I'm Dr. Romanov. Today our topic is hamstring work. Um, we will discuss um, about some misinterpreting uh, uh, the role of the hamstring and uh, particularly uh, how strong hamstring should be and what kind of strengths we need to develop for hamstring muscles. We have to understand that the hamstring in pose method of running plays a very specific uh, role. It's a function which is uh, related with pulling foot from the ground, nothing else basically. And uh, whatever we consider as a strength which develop in static uh, exercise with um, uh, weights or machines, it's not related really so much with running. It's not really not bad for running, but there are another thing what we have to do in, in running. And it's the uh, uh, most important thing that we have to pull foot timely and very quickly from the uh, ground. And foot by itself, it's only 2% of the body weight. So you uh, uh, make conclusion from this that it's not really about big force, but about proper timing of pulling the foot from the ground. So all drills what we are using in the in pose method, including machine, hamstring development, or free weights, finally come up to the dynamic exercise which we are performing uh, close to the, what running range is. And this kind of exercise like tapping, this kind of thing, you see it, this is no load, but it's timing very very precise timing of pulling foot from the ground or front lunge it's the same thing it's not about strengths but then we are developing very specific strengths for hamstring function in this really uh, important action of running uh, related with using rubber bands free weights partners resistance and so on so uh, in conclusion we need strengths of our hamstrings we need to develop their ability to be very strong, but most important thing is how quickly and precisely they are working for pulling foot from the ground. And we should not forget this importance at any stage of development of Poe's method of running. This is our topic for today. Thank you.